going on guys Eminate here today and basically i'm coming out with my new series erickson's endeavor this is the very first episode now the thing i'm going to be talking to you guys about first is this is two uploads in a row like two days consecutively it's not going to be happening a lot it's just i was off my um schedule and i didn't mean to upload the video i uploaded yesterday was actually supposed to go up monday but i didn't upload it so you guys get two videos in a row in two days. But anyway, let's jump into the series. So, we're going to be searching for a game real quick. And the game actually didn't take that long to find, which is really, really surprising because normally games take forever. But here, this is the team we're going to be playing. The very first game that we play is a full BPL team. Really solid. There's people like Sturridge, Sherla, Ozil, Fabregas, Navis, Kyle Walker, Mangala, T uh, that was actually John Terry, Aspetcoleta, and De Gea in goal. Now, that's a really, really tough team, but we get our first chance in the third minute, and we're passing it around nicely, um, trying to get Erickson involved. So, we do pass it to Erickson, and then he gets pushed off the ball. Now, Junior, which is a young, people, a young player that plays for Everton, passes it over to Erickson again. Erickson's in on goal, but cannot quite do it. But the seconds later, we get the ball back. We're passing it around once again really nicely. And Erickson goes in on goal and finishes it this time. Um, just a great finish and great team play. And we go up 1-0 in the 8th minute, 6th minute, something around there. I, I can't really remember. One of the other 6th or 8th minute. But very early, very early in this game we go up. And I was really surprised because the team was playing so well. Like, genuinely, it was playing so so well and I don't I didn't know why we're winning balls back in the midfield it was an absolutely just perfect performance up until this point and we jump into the second chance was for this guy but we win the ball back with our center back and we just we run up here with one of our players through ball to Isaiah Brown over to our other striker in the partnership and our second goal before 15th minute before the 15th minute two goals in 15 minutes it's absolutely just the dream start for us we did not expect this that's two up or one upgrade because Erickson already scored um but still a win is another upgrade which is great you know so this chance actually is us passing in the ground once again this comes literally like two minutes after and we go to, we go in back in with Isaiah Brown, and he finishes it this time. I don't even know. At this point, I didn't even know what was going on. There was too much going on, actually. And you, I mean, you can't blame me. I'm coming out here against a full BPL team that's gold, and I have a full bronze BPL team, and I'm winning 3-0 before the 20th minute. Like, I was going crazy. Um, This is another chance from him, and he gets in there and he actually misses it i thought he scored but apparently he didn't a huge save from the goalkeeper and i was just really ecstatic about that um but here comes another chance from him and at this point he was starting to put pressure on me and he was bound to score and he actually missed so that was kind of a surprise for me too i don't have very solid center backs and they're not that tall so i thought they were gonna Give that up pretty easily. But we're passing it around and we're starting to break down his defense more and more every time. Every time we start doing these quick little passes, he can't defend it. And we send another guy on goal, but he misses and cannot convert. But we do win a penalty, which I thought was a little bit sketchy. Didn't really think it was penalty deserved. Um, and then I looked at it and... I don't know if that's considered a penalty. You guys comment below if you think that's a penalty. He pushed me over in the box, but I don't know if that would have gone as a penalty in real life. Maybe it would have. Maybe it wouldn't. Who knows? But anyways, we line up against De Gea with Erickson because we want another upgrade. So we, of course, we're going to line up with Erickson for the penalty. And he just puts that away. He goes the right direction, but too much power on the shot. Still puts it in the back of the net. Great penalty from Erickson. That's two upgrades already. And I was ecstatic at this point. Two upgrades in the first game. What more could you ask for besides more upgrades? But two upgrades is still very, very good. And then this is the chance where he finally converted. He just ran right through my whole defense with Andre Sherla. And Sherla's going to finish that. 
nine times out of ten. Sherlock's a great finisher in this game. He's a great finisher in real life too. And he put that one away. And that was that was kind of a wake up call for me where I was like, I need to definitely just not let any more goals go in. I don't want to blow this lead. But at halftime, you can tell I had a lot more shots at him. I deserved to be winning. Had more possession. And we were just dominating him. My passing accuracy was 83. My shot accuracy was 87. I was taking my chances, passing it well. And this was a chance. And remember, the free kicks are two upgrades. And he put somebody on the line. But Erickson's free kicks, oh my god. The best free kicks I've used in this game. Now, I haven't had the luxury of using Ronaldo or somebody with like really, really, really good free kicks. But Erickson's free kicks are very very good like really really good and i watched this free kick over and over again because it was such a nice free kick you couldn't have placed it much better than that it went right over the defender's head and it just what a perfect free kick from christian erickson and i was very energetic about that that was a nice nice free kick and this was another chance from him and then I passed it out got after I got the ball, and he happens to get a red card, which was really unfortunate for him because I didn't see that as a red card challenge, but according to the ref, it was. So, you know, you got to do what you got to do. But this is his last chance. He's running in with Sturge. Sturge is going to finish that again. He's a clinical finisher. He's going to finish that 9 out of 10 times. And we happen to concede two goals. Um... That was in the 90th minute, so I really didn't care. I knew we weren't going to lose. But yeah, the game actually does finish 5-2. Our first game goes absolutely perfect, and Erickson is man of the match. He scores three goals, doesn't get any assists, but Isaiah Brown, and I think that's Loveridge or Liveridge or something like that, Livermore, something along those lines, Um, he scores a goal too. Our two striker partnerships scored. And Erickson scored three goals for the hat trick. So that's three upgrades plus the win is four upgrades. Plus the free kick is six upgrades, boys. We had six upgrades. That is absolutely just like fantastic. For our first game, six upgrades gets us a long way. Um, You'll see how I upgraded it after this screen. But I think I did pretty solid with the upgrades. Um... I noticed my defense, one of my defenders wasn't playing too very, very, like, solid. You know, he wasn't playing very solid. So, I went for a silver center back that I already had in my club, and it is Amat. Now, Amat is a Spanish defender from Swansea, and I saw Zuma right there, and I was like, dang, I could get Zuma. But, I figured I don't have to upgrade my other center back yet. And maybe I'll use Zuma when I have to upgrade my other center back. So my that's two upgrades on that. And then we have Morrison. James Morrison, that is a three upgrades because he goes from a bronze to a or bronze to a shiny bronze to a silver to a shiny silver. And the last one we upgraded was our left back. I played I think he played really bad. And we went with the Pacey, I think it's Baki Yogo or something. He looks incredible for a bronze left back, so I was like, why not use him? But that's all we have for you guys today. Hope you guys did enjoy. Don't forget to leave a like below, comment, and subscribe. See you guys later. Peace.